Hey guys, so here's our solar panels. We've got two of them on each float, mounted pretty much towards the uh, aft section of each float. Now I'm going to take you guys inside and show you how that power is converted and uh, how we boil our kettle with it. <coughs> Come inside, I'll open the cupboard and show you. You can see our solar regulators there flashing. There's a four at the bottom. The two at the top are redundant at the moment. We did make uh, room for six panels and uh, but we've only installed four because we're finding that we can you know the boat's running fine or four you know quite easily with a water maker running for a couple of hours a day if, if we do run it for a couple of hours normally one hour you know boiling cups of tea cooking fridge freezer we, we are we're running you know very efficiently and easily off the four panels probably different if it was really an overcast place for a week or so but um you know we just haven't had that kind of weather yet and anyway, they, um, so at the moment they're charging. And then that power goes down here from the regulators and it goes into our two lithiums. Now, wired into the uh, lithiums is this inverter. And the inverter is what powers uh, the kettle or the thermomix. Once the inverter's on, it's pretty easy. We just select the amount of time. It normally takes about four minutes to bring a, uh, or that amount of water to sort of up to around about 85, 90 degrees. We I never bother boiling it because it's too hot to drink anyway. So we'll take it up to 90. And then we, this is a blade control. And so we reverse the blade control and then we just turn the blades up to stirring. So it'll just, it stirs the water as it heats. And, uh, and then there you go, I'll come back in a couple of minutes and uh, see how it's going. Okay, so while that's boiling away, we'll get our little cup ready, our nice little pretty tea cup. We will pick our favourite tea out of our vast selection of teas, which is thanks to Claudia, she loves tea, so as you can see we've got quite a selection. <laughs> I'll pick my favourite. It's green and lemon tea. Probably because it's the easiest. Easiest to do because it's in the tea bag. This is our little incense burner. We like to have the boat smelling nice and uh, incense is a really nice way to do it. You can see it's been running for just over two minutes and uh, temperature's already up to 65 degrees. You can see these red lights come on to show you that the water's getting hotter. You see the inverter there drawing uh, anywhere up to nearly 90 amps and dropping back down to sort of 30 and up to 90. Okay, so you can see it's nearly at 90 degrees and it's still got around about 20 seconds to go. So uh, realistically it takes around about four minutes to boil enough water for say three cups of tea. You can see this is the amount of power that we've used. Uh, well, we haven't used this amount to boil the kettle. This is just how much we've used throughout the day. Okay, so you can see uh, it's now boiled. Just about. Ooh, steamy there. And there you go. Got your nice... Uh, Cup of tea. Down to around about nine, just under 93%. We're 94, so it uses about 1%, which is around about three, you know, three and a half, 3.6, 3.7 uh, amp hour to, uh, to boil the kettle. So realistically, very efficient and not too bad.